Hi guys. Hi. All right, guys. Sarah, come here, child. We want to talk to you guys about something today. Come, Joshua. All right. So, guys, today we were at church today, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, we are doing uh, the Daniel's fast. And we want to talk to you about the Daniel's fast. All right. So, first of all, let's hear what Sarah has to say about the Daniel's fast. Um, what I have to say about the fast mm -hmm. is that, well, fasting mm -hmm. is like giving up something, you know, um, taking from the flesh so that you could feed the spirit. Mm -hmm. That's what fasting is. So you basically are giving up something that you normally consume in your body mm -hmm. for, you know, to hear from God. Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, that's why we're doing the Daniel fast for the beginning of the year um, to fill our spirit. And so we're basically not eating meat, dairy, flour, mm -hmm. things like that. You know, things that our flesh um, craves. Loves and <laughs> <laughs> um, so that we can hear from the Lord. That's right. What about you, Josh? So what what um, what what do you think? What do you think of Daniel's fast is for you? What do you interpret it as? Just do it for God. Do it for God. Yes. Okay, but you have to pray too. Yes. Okay. What about you, Dave? Uh, me, I'm just trying to lose this belly. <laughs> <laughs> so Leah can't be on this belly no more. Soon, she's going to be like, Tree. <laughs> time, she's going to be like, Tree. <laughs> But yes, guys, it's, um, it's actually healthy too. And, um, you know, just make sure you pray while you fast. Anytime you're hungry. And since I just be hungry a lot, that means I just pray a lot. <laughs> Sometimes. As much as I can. But um, this is what we're eating. Tangerine, uh, grapes, <laughs> titi, no, that's not tomato. <laughs> no, um, just for me, especially no sweet, no meat, no flour, just brown rice. Um, coffee is one of the biggest ones that does the one. I had a headache. How many days? Uh, I had a headache for like two days. Today's? Last year yeah. was worse. It was like five days of like straight up withdrawal. <laughs> but it's worth it. It's worth it, right? Mm -hmm. So today we're going to lick up some bygone. <laughs> some bygone and Edo's. <laughs> so guys, so for me, the Daniel fast is to experience God in a different way. To me, the Daniel fast is to grow closer to God. And, um, you know, when you get hungry, as Sarah told me earlier, when you get hungry, you pray. You pray and you pray and you pray. And obviously, um, that's what I want. I want for this Daniel fast, I want to have a spiritual breakthrough with God. Um, so let's see what happens. I mean, at the end of the day, it's all about God and nothing else. All right. So we learned, what we learned at church today. <laughs> what we learned in mm. church today. We, we learned about the conqueror. A conqueror. Yeah. More, than, More conqueror. than a conqueror. What does that mean to you? What that means to me uh -huh. is that sometimes if we have an illness, uh -huh. we just ask God to cure the illness or get rid of the illness. We have to actually have faith and believe and plan what we are going to do after the illness. Because the illness is done already. You just have to believe it. And you just have to know that with God, you have the win already. So just plan what you're going to do after that. Plan all your vacations, everything that you're going to do after the illness or after the financial breakthrough or after the spiritual breakthrough or after anything you're dealing with whether it's family what is personal what is spiritual what is financial whatever it is just plan what you're going to do after that's end because remember the win is already written that's right what about you sir yeah <laughs> what, what that, sir? Yeah. <laughs> all right guys well at the end of the day there's power in the name of Jesus. If you believe there's power in the name of Jesus and you, when you pray, right? And you pray wholeheartedly and sincerely and you ask in the name of Jesus, boy, mountains move, right? I have seen it in my life, in our home, in our marriage with this, with this, Bungalanga boy here. No, no, I don't want to crush him no more. He ain't get crushed no more. I break them yeah. curses already. <laughs> hey, uh, yeah, but, but let me change the conversation before you go into more to me. <laughs> let me go more to David and not Dave. David and not Dave. Yeah. 
<laughs> well, the, the story about David and Goliath. Uh -huh. David was already planning mm -hmm. what he was going to do after he defeated Goliath. Everybody was scared of Goliath. Mm -hmm. Guess what David said? They would say, what is the reward after this uncircumcised Philistine <laughs> is dead? <laughs> Bye, God. We're going... Hold on, hold on. We're going to make some... He got a rose by gun and I go and curry some by gun. Guys, if you guys want to learn to talk, Trini, I'm going to put like the ugliest by gun there, man. Let me show one good one. <laughs> if you guys want to learn how to talk, Trini, I want you to pro practice this. What a pound for the by gun. What a pound for the by gun? Yeah, that's how Trinidadian people are stuck like this. Like, I'm just going to say, what the price for the, for the balanje? Then go say, what a pound for the by gun. Who says that? Who says what a pound for the by gun? We, Trini people, what yeah, a pound for the by gun? better you say, uh, how much for one balanje? What's a balanje though? This is a balanje. You don't know what's a balanje? <laughs> <laughs> this is a balanje. You have a bygone song so much nicer. Why are you eating the balanje? Hi <laughs> uh, guys. What a pound for the bygone. Hi <laughs> uh, guys, stay tuned, okay? <laughs> so guys, look at the bygone. So David's going to roast these three and I'm going to curry these three with Edo's. Right? What can we get here? We got Palm City today, Golden Apple, and June Plum, the Jamaican scholar. All right. I just say, guys, I will tell you guys this. You see Holly Branch? Sarah grew up in Holly Branch and Seven Seas Cod Liver Orange Flavor. Right? Mm -hmm. And let me tell you, Sarah has never had a flu shot ever in her life. No. Right, Sarah? No, no flu shot. Never had a flu, flu shot ever. So. If you guys, you know, I'm not a doctor, I'm not a pharmacist, um, but I will recommend this for your kids. No, you no. have the babies, you have the little kids, I'll recommend the Holly Branch. It's good stuff. Um, you know, we, Dave and I got sick recently, but baby Leah barely had a fever and she was knocked out of it. Josh, you don't, you don't really get sick, so, so that's awesome because they take this. Yes, inject your kids them with some Holly Branch. Not inject them, baby. Oh, oh. <laughs> uh, well, yes, if you want to tell, tell, let me know, $19.99 of Apple. Oh, Lord. <laughs> uh, because we can't import them from Guyana. No, it's not coming from Guyana, it's coming from the West Indian store. Oh, oh, but you tell the people like that. What's <laughs> favorite medicine? What? Buckley's. Buckley's. <laughs> tell them what happened to the Buckley's. So, Sister Tracy, so one of the sisters of my church, gave us um, Buckley's, what, three weeks ago? Mm -hmm. And what happened when I gave David? That Buckley went straight through. <laughs> it went right through. It was like... <laughs> was oh my gosh. It was not good. I told David, I said, listen, back in the days, we used to real drink shots of tequila and Patron and thing. Why you can't take a shot of Buckley's? When you take the Buckley's, you want to die. <laughs> Man, that Buckley's went straight to my bottom. Man! Yeah, yeah. Guys... Uh, so we got, what are you going to do here? I'm going to roast this. I don't uh -huh. know if you guys who ever grew up in the Caribbean, uh, West Indies or whatever. Um, they, this is cashew, raw cashew. So you got, um, you got, you got, you got patch it. You yes. got to roast, roast it. Roast it. I don't know if you guys remember as a kid who can come from back home, roasting the cashew nut. That was the best, that was the best sweet ever. This was actually, we, because we couldn't afford candy and couldn't afford sweet. So we had to roast Cashew nut. I know, I know, I know. It's so not crazy. We're going to teach you guys how to roast cashew nut. For the ones who know already, you know. Yeah. Well, last you roast cashew nut, though, babe? No. I was about Josh age. I was about 10. No. Really? Wait, I remember you roasting it. Well, yeah. last night was fast. Yeah. What, yeah? How it is? We're all roasted. Yeah, you got to roast it. That's raw. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hope we don't go straight through. I want you guys know. Yeah, your bow is real clean, why? I'm telling you, I'm cleaning everything right now. You right? healthy like a house. Look, 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 look. What a pump for the bygan. Look, 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 look. Bygan here. Look at bygan there. All right, guys. A little. What's the, what's the temperature today, sir? It's like 60 degrees outside. Excuse my backyard. We are fixing the pavers right now. It's 60 degrees outside, guys. <laughs> and you know how you can tell? Look, this is how you can tell it's 60 degrees outside. It's a little cold. This is, how, this is how we measure the temperature. Bro, yeah, I don't want you to be wearing a bra just now. You better hey, start hey, hey, working hey. that out. I better, I, I, I'm about to poke this short already. <laughs> so All guys, right. We are going to make smoke rose by gun. Smoke rose by yeah, gun. Guys, this is smoke rose by gun, Dave style, right? Dave style. But actually, we're going to use a little recipe from uh -huh. Amisha's Cuisine 
from a boy, um, Richard Archibalds. I'm Mr. Cousin, okay, yes, okay. I'm Cousin. So guys, this is gonna be, the smoking part I add to it, but the rest of the recipe is from Mr. Archibalds. So Mr. Archibalds, if you're hearing, um, I'm gonna use some of your recipe for the bag and choke, all right? Richard Archibald. Archibalds. <laughs> and big shout out to his wife, Amy, who is my sister, and his kids. This guy, this guy got more, more, more cheering than anything else. Right? I don't know how he got so much cheering. When he go out, he got conked and cheering to when they're coming in back the car. I think about 12 years. Um, yeah, so big shout out to Aaron, <laughs> Amisha, Alicia, and little Abby. Love you guys. Aww. So we're preparing the fire for the smoke by guys. Yes, yes, yes. You see, Rich, you rub off on him a little bit. You so see, he, look, he look, can look. cook one now, thing. Now I am a chef. Now I am a chef. Gosh, boy. Look hey. at that. Hey, they call me the bygone man. Hey, hey, put it in the thing. No, no, that's good, baby. I'm going to burn. That's okay. better. I'm better now, baby. All right. So now they call me Mr. Bygan, the mm. bygone man. The bygone man. Yeah. So when you see me on the road, holla, bygone. Are you for real? <laughs> you were Orlando to call you bygone? What's wrong with bygone? <laughs> Or Balanje, call me Balanje. I tell you, Balanje is more hard to say. No, no, no. I say Balanje by gun. Or I call me Balanje and call Trisha by gun. No, no, please don't call me by gun, guys. <laughs> All right, look at me, papaya, guys. Look at me, papaya on oh, that tree. Look, we're still doing construction. Nice, yeah. Still in construction right now. Still. They were done from inside, but now it come outside. Yeah, and we said last, we said, when we finished with the kitchen inside, we said, okay, we're going to do this next year, late next year. But nope, we started like right after that. Next year come too quick. Yeah. Yeah, the, we said we was going to do it next year. And today is what? Today is the, the sixth, the seventh. Oh my gosh. So next year come already. I know. The guy actually removed all the pavers from here already. And he leveled it up. He put what? Sand and stuff, right, babe? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he, he's really good. He's really, really good. It's looking good so far. You got to pressure wash it and you got to seal it back and stuff like that. Because I don't want to see no dirt in here. Yeah. So, good job. Good job to Fernando. So, guys, we had a chef here. He washed me by gun and thing. Yeah. Make sure you wash your by gun clean. <laughs> Take out all the paper. Make sure you take out the price so people don't know how much you pay for the bygan. <laughs> how do you know? <laughs> hey, bygan expensive, America. America? America. Okay, America. And Diana, we plan this and we get bygan all year. <laughs> We're so, looking for garlic. Hey, so make sure, yeah, make sure you, um, you wash hey, your Hey, hey, that's my, that's my little thing I'm going to do over there. So we don't have more garlic? See, no. Yes, yes. So you know, you're going to peel garlic already? No, I don't peel garlic. I don't buy peel garlic no more. Very rare now because it spoils very quickly. It spoils very quickly. Yeah, and I, I, I read something recently. There was an article that um, the mold that grows on the garlic, it could cause cancer. What? Yeah, I know that's weird, but... I never heard of that, man. Well, you didn't read the article. I should send the article to you. That people making up stuff, man. No, it's not true, baby. It, it, I, I believe it's... true? No, he, what he said, people are making up stuff, it's true. It's scientific evidence, baby. Scientific evidence? Yeah, you see Bill not to hit the garlic now. Nah. What did you do, know, Right there. Man, crusher. Yeah, look. <laughs> Guys, you got to improvise. If you don't have a bell in your house, you use this. And look, you, know, you just do like this. See? Oh, see? that's uh, you that. Oh, you got to show Sarah that. Yeah, look how easy it is. Easy. Now. You see, look how easy, easy you peel it now, you see? Nice, nice. No, Dad, I don't know what I'm doing. All right, that's fine. No, teach him. He got to learn how to peel garlic. Hey, 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 hey. You got to be able to cook too when you get big enough. Yes, yes. Who will cook for your wife? You know when somebody else cook for your wife? Correct. You got to cook some salad roti and dal and rice for your wife. You got to learn how to cook. Your favorite food. Dal and rice. <laughs> that's the dal and rice. So get all our muscles, Josh. You see, you see how your daddy got some more muscles? Uh-huh. Check him out this morning, man. In the in the bathroom doing push-ups. I was like, what? All the push-ups for who? <laughs> uh, I won't be able to lift you up. What? Wait, you say heavy? No, I just saying if I'm if I fire then now uh, and I gotta lift you up and run with you now, what will happen? <laughs> <laughs> I don't wanna fart myself. <laughs> what? Alright, baby, alright, I can take that one. Try to tell me I a little oompa. <laughs> I won't be able to pick you up, you know? <laughs> A man must be able to pick up your wife. Listen, this is a test. So you can't pick me up now? Ladies. Wait, yeah. wait, wait, wait. You can pick me up now? Yeah, but uh, you know how you're fasting, you know? I, I, I got to make sure, you know? 
Wait, 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 wait. What, what, what are that supposed to mean? It's supposed to mean I want to challenge all them husbands. No, 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 no. We're going back to picking me up first. You think you can pick me up right now? So let me let me, let me try. Hold yeah, this camera. Right now, right now, no, 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 no. Okay. I want to see how weak your hand is. Come. Hold no, this camera. No, no, no. Hold this camera. Come. No, 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 no. Come, let me see. I'm feeling the No, no, no. Watch the hand. Watch the hand. All right, guys. Stand up. <laughs> I feel like somebody's gonna get hurt. Can you come pick up your wife and run with shit? Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pick sure. up. He passed it, Jess. He passed it, Jess. <laughs> Guys, so this is the next step. You get the ugliest bike gun you can find, right? <laughs> Uh, you make sure you scrape off the price so nobody can see the price. <laughs> nobody can see what I bought for the bygan. <laughs> and then you start, you act like you're vexed with the bygan. You make some stab on it like this. <laughs> so make sure you bore up your bygan a little bit. Where? Uh, bore your bygan. What do you mean bore? Bore, 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 bore. A bore is a pig. No, no, you bore them, you bore them like with a knife, you joke them. Or joke your bygan. <laughs> All right. You put hole. Yeah, you you, it. Yeah, you put hole in it. Then you stuff it with garlic. Make sure you get one of the Ben Up Bygan, like, you know, that the straight one and that tastes so good, like the Ben Up one now. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh, make sure you fill it up with garlic. Well, I guess you gotta bore the hole a little more big. If you, if, if it depends on the garlic. If you garlic, uh, big garlic, you bore the hole more big. And then you put it in there. If the garlic now go, you force me. <laughs> I don't know, like this garlic go win. All right, it went in. It went in? It went in. All right, so you see, this is what you do. I want you to check out my bag on guys. They already cut and washed already. And now I'm doing the edos. Alright, once you fill up the bag on with garlic, you call this this part is what we call the garlic bagan. The garlic bagan? This yeah. edo's not good, man. Yeah, this um you garlic up the bagan here. And then you take this mm, some this half not good. I'll give them five. See this guys, I love Edo's. If you guys ever had um, Edo's choker, like how you make alu choker, I love Edo's choker. I love white Edo's with salt fish. It's a master. Guys, you put them like you roll it up <laughs> and doubles like this. If the bike can bend, you'll go sideways, but you straighten them back up. Once you roll them up, I need you, you I think you need to go to mommy, but you should have to roll doubles and all. Cover up here, you see? See, and now, we are going to them to um, Sam, Savi's um, Calypso Cuisine, Sav, Trini, um, Savi Trini Taste in, uh, in Port, Port St. Lucie. Port, no, Port, Port, Port Pierce. Port, Port, oh, Pierce. Port Pierce, my wow, bad. Wow, guys. Port <laughs> Pierce, Calypso Cuisine in Port Pierce. Big up to Uncle Shane uh -huh. and Mommy. Yes, yeah, right now my mother said there a whole bunch of chana and all kind of things she, vegetables she cooking to send for me this week. And I'm bring it for me. Oh, yeah? Mm. And I go check out the boy Rambo. They have a sexy cashier there. The boy got muscles <laughs> and things. The boy only started going to the gym like 30 and, days. And he free single and disengaged, ladies. So, hey, I grab your number. Yeah, hey, name Rambo. Yeah, that's yes. the boy. Imagine the man named Rambo and he look like Rambo. You see the boy, the boy got abs. When you go there, ladies, well, just ask him, ask him to show you your abs. Yeah, he's a cashier there, okay, yeah, guys? Yeah. <laughs> Are you lucky I married already or else I'll, I'll try me abs? Are you lucky? Babe, Rose, you had abs 20 years ago. Excuse me? You never have abs after that, baby. How do you know that? I can see. No, that's, that's because I never show you. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, you have a watermelon there. Hey, hey, hey. I left my watermelon alone, yes? I like the watermelon, baby. Okay, okay. <laughs> Guys, so this is the secret of the smoke by gun. This, that's why we call it smoke by gun choker Dave style. This is the secret right here. Right? This, this is what gonna give it that smoke, smoky flavor. So put that there. You put this here, and you put your bike down. Don't put it in the direct fire. So why? So you don't want it to burn or cook too quickly. You want it to get soft, but you want it to use the heat, not the fire. 
So I'm ready to chunk here this bygone and edos. So I'll make, put, mix in my little curry paste here. Put my little curry powder, my little chief curry powder. I have a little masala put in here. Chief masala from Trinidad. <laughs> and then I have my little Incy Binsa Pira. I put it in there too. Guys, I cook differently from you guys. So, you know, I'm not, I'm not a chef. My little turmeric powder. But um, my mother is a chef. My father is a chef. My brother, he like to eat. <laughs> right, man? Oh. Ashton, Ashton like to eat? Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, now I can mess with him, right? He's mess with me all the time, and so I can mess with him. All right, guys, so check it out. So we're going to mix it up here. Put it on the stove. It smell like curry. You want to eat this? I'm okay, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put a little water in here. Normally, if I had fresh grind seasoning, I would have put it in here, but it's okay. I don't have none right now. And guys, I have to cook very clean. Um, so we cannot use um, regular oil. I gotta use a little olive oil because, you know, a very little bit. At least just to fry up the seasoning and the curry. This is olive oil I use in here. So I pour a little bit in there. And I have my arrows. And my arrows. I have my baygan. <laughs> so I'll fall out here. Hold on, hold on. Can I rinse it out? And my baygan. I have my onion. My garlic. I have pimentos. And I have um, curry pillar leaf. Who know what curry pillar leaf is? Curry leaf. Curry leaf. And then we have, we have to be, we, we're not using regular salt, so we gotta use a little sea salt. So, this is the food for today. And then they make me choke up. But I want to show you how I cook my curry bacon. Again, guys, I'm not, I'm not a chef, so forgive me if I don't cook it your way. All right? I still love all you. <laughs> Onion. Mama. Onion first. Check it out. How are you looking there, guys? Real oniony. Real oniony and it smell oniony too. Mm -hmm. Ah, smells so good. I'm going to throw my curry pillow leaf in there. I want that to fry up too. Guys, when I cook, my mother is calling and asks me what kind of madness I'm doing. So I want to know how I survive all these years. <laughs> my mother's a big chef in her, guys. That lady been cooking forever, she whole life, since she's like 13 or 12 years old. And when I was small, when I was growing up in Trinidad, I remember about between 11 and 13, no, I was going to senior sex, so I was about 14. No, no, junior sex. So between that age, 13 to 15, while I was still in Trinidad, um, I used to wake up early in the morning and cook roti and probably buy gran alu or something, or fry alu before I go to school. I want to ask Sarah, <laughs> and I was so small, I have to go after I've done cooking the roti and cook all the food, the breakfast, I have to walk all the road in Kearney, in Harlem, take the maxi, <coughs> go all the way to school, right? So I will ask Sarah, Sarah, could we ask you this sure. question? Have you ever wake up early to cook breakfast for us? Before school? Uh -huh. No. Ah, why not? Why not? Because, okay, I'm going to quote mom on this. Uh -huh. My time is not your time. <laughs> <laughs> So, <laughs> my time is not your time, Mom. Okay. That is my response. Thank you. <laughs> you see, see, guys, our kids are lucky today. They don't have to do or go through the things that we went through. But that's okay. Because we don't want them to go through those things. And you guys don't even eat breakfast. 
Yeah, the coffee. Yeah. Rough. And the tea. Cause normally I'll drink like about oh, seven babe. cups of tea a day. Now I can't even drink no tea. I'll be only drinking peppermint tea. <laughs> this is what I'm drinking. It's so good. Mm -hmm. I love peppermint tea. It's delicious. What come? Show them what tea I have in here. All kind of tea I have in here. Oh my Lifting. gosh. Turmeric tea. I have to drink this and it's not fun. <laughs> this one is good. This is from, I think, Brazil. This one? No, this is coffee, but we can drink that. Well, this looks like Sandy Cup of Tea here, man. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Big up to Sandy Cup of Tea. Big up to uh, Miss Sandy uh, and the Sandy and Uncle Mike. Oh, my gosh. We love you guys. Big up to you guys. Josh is fasting from sugar. So, Josh, how's that going? Oh, good. <laughs> I just want some sugar. Yeah? So when the fast is over, what do you think you're going to eat? Uh, I'm going to ask Sarah to get some ice cream. <laughs> ice cream? Oh my gosh, what I want. When I break my fast, I want some nice, <laughs> bungee dry, curry duck. duck. Or and, duck curry. No, curry duck, bungee dry. I don't want no sauce, I don't want no gravy in it. No bungee duck, no aloo no. I don't want no aloo but no, duck, no, no. babe. <laughs> I don't want no aloo my duck. How can you not? Hello, hello, I fasted right now. Hey. Trinidadian people, I should get a ticket, you should get a fine <laughs> for not putting aloo in a duck. No worry, in, he, in, in, no worry. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to put oh, this in here now. So okay, check it out, guys. So now I'm going to put my curry powder. Mm -hmm. My curry paste powder. And let that cook there. So guys, a steel two leaf um they bond done yeah from there. <laughs> and I put it in my bag on. Guys, I like bandanya. Oh my gosh. I like green onions. Green onions? Mm -hmm. I don't look in this here. Look at that. Look at that goodness, Sarah. It's like, it's Sarah, like curry I'm, onion. <laughs> I'm treating you well here, you know. So when you're married, you cook to your husband. I don't know if he's gonna like this. Maybe he's gonna like <laughs> because it. Because I don't like this. I don't like edos. You like it all? Mm -mm. We could put potatoes in it. Nah, we don't know aloo, mommy. I aloo know. for aloo, choke and fry aloo. Well, if I'm the one cooking it, then he'll have to so eat it. So when we come over your house now, what are you going to give me? I'll give you the potatoes. No, 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 I want edos. Mashed potatoes. I want curry edos with saijan and shrimp inside. Oh. Maybe no. You're going to have to eat that, Josh. Uh. Yeah, Josh, why do I have to cook some good food for me, Josh? You going to make sure you cook that for me? No. Why not? No, no. <laughs> but enough no. for you, right, for me? Yeah, but then, but then I don't want her to learn how to make it because she probably might like, like it. <laughs> what if she's, so, but she's she's Indian. She can know how to make it. Yeah. Judge, why are you moving back slowly? Like <laughs> <laughs> All right. Look at her looking there, guys. Frying up nice in there. Mm. I smell like curry, but guess what? I ain't going no way. This is our natural smell. <laughs> <laughs> I am, after we done cook, we're going to eat, and then we're going to go on that beautiful area. Let's show them, show them, show them. And we're going to play a game of Scrabble. And we are going to close all the curtains, take out all the lights, and we're going to watch our movie, and we're going to snore. We're going to do a church thing. After church, we sleep. Yeah, well, I was trying to do that, but everybody want to cook curry, curry edos, and curry vegan. Bike and ego, ego, edo curry. Look how nice I'm looking. That'll smell good. Just put your face like that. You'll get burned. That'll smell good. It smells good. It smells good. good. But just put some. And I have some water cress in the fridge. Oh, I just sand it out with his fingers. So nice and short. These nails is not like Dave. That's <laughs> nails are short. <laughs> I don't have one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> my nails are short. Uh, no, those are long. They're not long. <laughs> All right, you look at that. Weird. Huh? You guys are just weird. We're not weird, Sarah. We, we're just flat. Um, put some tomatoes in here. So guys, look how nice it looks in here. Look, everything fry up nicely. So now I'm gonna go put the nice edos here. The nice? <laughs> the delicious edos, my favorite. Look at that. Let that cook for a little bit. 
because you know that's more hard, right? Whoa. So guys, this is how it's gonna get the smoky flavor. So let me see what these young ladies doing over here. What are you doing there, baby? So I'm, I'm making something called chip, chip leaves. It's a Haitian salad. It's so delicious. One of the sisters in my church, she made it. But you put red onions, pepper, hot pepper, um, sweet pepper, yeah. carrots, and cabbage. You put vinegar and lime and tomatoes, and you put it on your rice. Mm. So that's what I'm doing here. This is gonna go with the. That's what we got here. Yeah. No, no. This is my Trinidad. I make a Trini salad here. So I'm gonna mix this with it because I don't want it to waste it. I just have everything else in here that we need. Guys, yeah, it's, it's just a trend. I don't like to throw away nothing. That's there. right. Nothing. I... So you see, oh, wait, this, wait, wait, this wait, wait, salad wait. she was gonna throw away. Look, she no. improvising oh, on, and she making making pickly. Guys, oh, hold on. I ain't showing you. Hey, 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 hey! Because I was I the guy in Star Boy. That's why. Oh. <laughs> Why are you laughing? I'm not. She don't know how my, my guy in his house when I love him enough. Exactly, exactly. She don't yeah. know. Yeah. <laughs> don't worry, we'll get a guy in his boy for she. Woo! Huh? A nice guy in his boy. <laughs> Who come from. Um, leg one. Not leg one. Uh, what's the yeah. next place? Um, hubu? No, Hubu. Um, Bagdam? Not Bagdam. <laughs> um, not. Uh, what are you, Burbies? One, two, and three? Which one is that? What are you, Madhouse? <laughs> All right, guys. So bring it, bring it, show them in. So see the arrows here. So your bundy arrows. Look, this is how you have bundy arrows. All right. So now I'm gonna go put the bygone in. Bring it, baby. All right. Put the bygone in here so now. So your bundy arrow first, then you throw the bygone. Check it out. I'll lower the stove a little bit. How it looking, guys? Well, it's smelling real good. No, I bite. smell good, guys. I smell good. I'm. But here when I'm hungry too, so. <laughs> and listen, with this fast, when you're hungry. You're hungry. There's nothing to satisfy you. You have to pray. No, yeah, when you're hungry, you're hungry. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> hungry. Yes. You know what's a powerful, um, a powerful prayer? The Lord's Prayer. And also, um, my grandmother taught me when I was small growing up in Trinidad. Rest her. Um, rest in peace. Her name was Lakia Isaac. That was my grandmother's name from Karani. Hola Sapi. Yeah. And my grandmother used to, um, when we were small, she will, she taught us to pray and stuff. And um, she would sing hymns with us, like real old hymns. And, oh my gosh, my grandmother was amazing. But what she did is, I lost my train of thought now. I was telling you something and you tell me about Sapi. <laughs> Guys, I think this part too big for this. Uh, no, I'm gonna it's so, gonna walk down. Good, don't worry. This is gonna go melt down real oh, quick. Oh, it's gonna melt. Well, so what my grandmother boy? You make me forget. You say your grandmother used to improvise and she used to sing. Oh no, no, yes, I know what she's talking about because she used to um one of the most powerful psalms in the Bible is Psalms 91. If you have any fear, um, and you you you're very fearful, you open that psalm and you read that psalm with knowing that god is going to work everything out and have faith in it it's 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 amazing psalm 91 mm -hmm. i'll tell you the first few words he that dwells in the secret place of the most high shall abide under the shadow of the almighty i will say of my god he's my refuge and my fortress my god in him will i trust surely he shall deliver thee from the snare faller and from the something pestilence under his wings shall your shall his truth be thy shield and buckler you shall not be afraid of the terror by night, nor for the arrow that fleeth by day, nor for the destruction that wastes at noonday. A thousand shall fall at your side, and ten thousand at thy right hand, but it shall not come nigh thee. Only with your eyes you shall see the wicked. Which there's a few more, but what I'm saying is, it's a very powerful verse. Psalm 91. Hallelujah. Look at the chicken water you left over there. No, I chicken water, I buy gun water. <laughs> Ooh, this looking good, man. Yes, yes. Oh, one of the bygone fall on. Hey, hey, hey. Bygone expensive. Don't waste the bygone. We got the, we got the five second rule. Five second rule? Mm-hmm. 
All right, guys, so how you look there? So I'm gonna put a little bit of sea salt, not too much because we shouldn't be eating sea salt, any type of salt, but a little bit of sea salt and boom, done. That's it? That's it. The bygun smoking, boy, it's smoking. See all that smoke? All right, I think it ready there, man. Look at that. We gotta check, see if it's off. If it's off, it's ready. This one looks safi safi. This one good. Let us see this one. Oh yeah, that's good man. Guys, this bike and ready to clean up. Alright. Alright guys, look at this. It ready. Alright, so we're gonna go carry these small boys and clean them up. Yep. Smell right. good. Look at that. Look at this smoke. It kinda looks like a oh, steak in the wrapping. Yeah, look at this. Um, I think the um, nice baby. Which one? My one? Yeah. So, guys, uh, this one is fine. No, I was using that one, but Okay. So, so guys, you this is what you do. You guys act like there's no more knife. I know, like, uh -huh. 50 knife in there. Can I get a spoon, sir? Ooh. Look at this. Huh? Mm, you can smell that smoke now, guys. Uh -huh. Look at that. Look at this steak. The steak. Oh, oh. This thing smells like steak, man. <laughs> the thing is getting foggy from the smoke. Okay, so you can <laughs> go a little bit farther. That looking good there, baby. Oh, yeah. Let me see. What? This thing smells like sister? steak, baby. Oh, wow. See? <laughs> oh yeah. What? Okay, so. Smell good. Oh okay, okay. okay. You were saying smell horrible. It smells good. You sure? It smells good. Say so good. Eat your bag and choker. Huh? Yeah. You gonna eat some bag and choker? No. Why not? It's good. <laughs> I don't wanna eat it, but it's good. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at this guy. It looks like That's spaghetti. some goodness there, baby. Oh man, mama. It looks like steak when it's there. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. We gotta make umpagar next. Umpagar. Yeah, next week we're gonna make journey week we're gonna make some umpagar. Ooh, what's umpagar, baby? Umpagar is a trini thing. What's that what's it's, what trini it's, thing? it's it's um tomatoes, um onion, garlic, okra, and pepper. You roast everything and mush it up. Oh, you mash it up in your belly or you got mash it? It mashed up in the bowl. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Did a good job, baby. All right. So check it out, guys. So you don't have to, you know, I remember, um, you know, growing up, my gra I used to make the bygone and I will just have the oil and throw it in there with the onion and stuff. If you look closely, bygone produces oil. Oh yes. You see that? You can like cook in its own oil. Yeah, you don't, you don't have oil. to you don't have to chunky it with oil. Look at that. Matter of fact, um soon we will start selling bygun oil. <laughs> Vegetarian oil straight from the bygun. <laughs> it's gonna call Guyana Balanje Isle. Guyana Balanje yeah, Because you know how Guyana produce oil. Now Guyana should like take out oil even from bygun. <laughs> you so silly. This man is a goat boy. <laughs> A uh, goat, that's a really good. Imagine if we can harvest this vegetarian oil. I don't know how that from a vegan. Hey, you never know. Well, looking good, they looking good. Look at that. Look at that. Guyanese steak, boy. This is Guyanese steak. Oh, Bengali Babu. Oh, oh Guyanese Babu. Babu. I am the very best of the Bengali Babu. Oh, yeah. Shaka, 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 shaka. I am the very best. Scooty Bob, Scooty Bob. They come from the country. They call Guyana. And now the box and the rice and sugar. How you know the words better than me? Because when I was small, I liked that song. No, no, no. That's because you come from Hubu Bagdam. From where? From Bagdam. Bagdam? Yeah. Hubu Bagdam. <laughs> Hubu Bagdam sounds like a bird or something. A black bird or something. No, there's a place called Hubu Bagdam in Guyana. I'm going to take my day then. Okay. 
Yes. I'm going to take you back to your roots. The my roots, yes. My <laughs> culture. <laughs> Guys, she is Trinidadian and people just ask me, which part of Guyana she from? <laughs> Guys, I love Guyanese people. What are you going to say? What are you going to say, boy? What are you going to say? It's the oil. Not the oil, boy. The Guyana had no oil before. I, I like Guyanese people. It's the Balanje Isle. <laughs> 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 oh, my <baby>, mama. <laughs> Are they ready to see the goodness here? Voila. Mm, look at that. Come on. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. This is so much better than eating curry duck right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, God forgive me. I just say a lie. Lord Jesus, forgive me. <laughs> No, 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 we don't lie anything. <laughs> All right, look at that, look at that. But for real, though, I'm looking forward to eating this. I really am. So let me show what we're we doing here now. So, we don't oh, have, sorry. we have the <laughs> stuff here for the chiplees, 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 what do you call it, chiplees? We have the onion. I call it the Haitian spicy salad. I oh. call it chicken peas. Chicken peas, <laughs> carrots, onions. I don't have no red onions, Sarah, use it out. So I have, I put regular onions, I have the cabbage, I put a little piece of hot pepper, and I put some watercress. Check it out. Nice. Looking good, right? Next, I'm going to add my Trinic salad I made two days ago. Your old salad. Your old salad. <laughs> well, I, think, I think you butcher enough the people recipe, baby. Now nah, well, I'm making it, you know. Trini style. Trini style. <laughs> like, Where you got to trini up everything? Huh? Where everything you got to trini up? Because that trini, that what trini people do. You make everything, everything into a trini thing. <laughs> <laughs> everything trade out them people are trini up, boy. He just jealous. Don't be jealous, baby. Don't be jealous. This guy needs steak looking good, though. Alright, chiply. I just messed the red onions, but that's alright. I'm gonna make it again this week and I'm gonna put some red onions in there. And now we're gonna go put some Ta -da! vinegar. Which one look better? Which one look better? Look at My this. one look better! Look at this guy. Guys, look at this guy. Look hey, at look this. that, look at that, look at that. Tell me who one look better. Yeah, look at this. Look I at think this. they will look good together. <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean, I want to train you up my bike and, my, my bike and joke. <laughs> Mash up all the garlic, look. That's what will give it that nice garlic flavor. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Come on, man. You guys yeah, can't yeah. Look tell. at this. Look at this, hey, guys. Look. Hey, 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 hey. Move now, boy. Hey, hey, look at this. Look, 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 look. This boy needs to move here. Look at right, this. Right, it right, smells you. so good. Oh, man. That does smell good. Huh? Vinegar. Now I'm going to squeeze some lemon. With some white rice. Oh, man. Uh -huh. No, no white rice. Oh, no? Brown rice. I mean brown rice. Uh-huh. A yeah. half a lemon. I'm going to do a half of lime. Remember when we were in Ecuador and we had something like that with the fish? Oh, yeah. Oh, that, that was good, good. yeah. Oh that was gosh. really good. It's called, what they call La Bruja. La Bruja? If you guys, anytime in Ecuador, in Galapagos, order a fish they call La Bruja. The, the, the fish is called the witch in English, but in Spanish it's La Bruja. It's a huge fried fish with this stuff on it. Oh, my goodness. And some Real? fried tostones. Oh, boy. <laughs> We're going to put black pepper. This boy want to win me here. Look at that. Come on, Sarah. You know I'm loving that right now? A little sea salt. Da -da 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 -da. Nothing, Ow! Nothing can be that. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, tell me what looks better. That or this look? Hey, those are two totally different things. <laughs> Just going to eat with the rice and the... Edo's and Baigan. Come on. Guys, so they've eaten Baigan choker with rice. I never eat Baigan choker with rice yet, so let me see how that goes. Guys, you gotta eat Baigan choker with some rice and you gotta eat it with your hand. You gotta sun it. You see, when you're done, you start to lick your finger. Just make sure you don't scratch your body when you're eating it. So this way, you know, you gotta wash your hands steady, steady. So you sun it with your hand. Oh, I'm gonna lick your finger. <laughs> That's your daddy, Stella. <laughs> That's your daddy. <laughs> All right, so you got to taste it now, Stella. Um, Why well, you can't taste it first? No, no, no. What? So, guys, the garlic bonder. You guys see that? 
Now put in the onion a little bit. And the rest of the stuff. Oh man, I'm selling this stuff. I'm still this stuff. See, I'm putting the rest of my stuff in there. See that? And I put a special ingredient right here, the baigata. This is it right here. This is the goodness. This guys with this smoke flavor yes guys I already I put a little bit of salt in it sea salt so this is it look at this goodness here all right now we pass it over back into the bowl how it smells, Joshua? Very good. Look at that. Mm -hmm. We like to put a little extra onion to get that crunch. Right, Joshua? Yes, please. Look at this. Guys, look at this goodness right here. This is what dreams are made of. Right here. <laughs> oh it is it's master all right let me try it now go ahead You eat out half of it. This girl, when she when she cooks, she tastes. Right. When, by the time the food don't she taste out half so of it. So guys, food. I don't burst some of these, but all of this is for me. I put it over the side there to steam a little bit, you know? Because you don't want to make Dave cry and Sarah cry, you know? Uh-huh. How that look in there, baby? That look like when that paper busts your fat smoke there, man. All right, so we ready. The smoked baigan choka ready. Uh, the baigan curry ready. Uh, the I thought it was a baigan balanje. Or the balanje curry ready. Um, and the pickney ready. The I mean the, the pickneys. See. All right, guys, we just done pray, <laughs> but uh, we paused it to pray. But I want to tell you guys something. The Bible says a family that prays together, eat together, stays together, <laughs> stays together. You grow together. You love one another. Together. Together. All right. Anyway, let, let me let me let me let me let me dig in here. Come, come, bring it, bring it, bring it, sir. So I have my bagan curry bagan with edos. I'm a little brown rice here. I'm a pickles, I'm a bag and choke out my pepper. With some coconut water. And coconut water. Cheers, guys. <laughs> and I got sand it with your finger. But before I do that, you guys can eat. Before I do that, I want to do a shout out to all our lovely subscribers. Thank you guys. Because without you guys, seriously, this channel would not be where it is. We are right now, I think, 5,100. <laughs> 5148 and it's because you guys you guys make it possible because the more you comment on our video and like our video and share our video it more it goes more um it is able to reach more people so thank you for uh for commenting thank you for liking and thank you for sharing thank you so so much from the bottom of our hearts okay when we started a year ago it was just a few people and now we are five thousand plus but thank you guys okay we love you guys and yes guys we started with five people now it's over five thousand so i want to say thank you very much thank you very much to everyone that wished me happy birthday my birthday was the third my 24th birthday so 42 only alia is 42 42 42. 42. <laughs> we started started with five and three of them was us. <laughs> yeah, we started with five subscribers and three subscribers was us. Uh -huh. 
so thank you guys so much for the love and support um if 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 you guys didn't comment or didn't support us the way you do we, we probably wouldn't be making videos correct and um i want to encourage you to please comment on the videos because i ha we have a lot of subscribers that don't comment just anything just say anything so we can uh we will know who you is we'll get familiar with you guys so anytime you guys have body shout out we know you a little bit you know so no, don't just watch make sure especially for the older folks make sure you you the subscribe button make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the thumbs up mm -hmm. so this way we can meet reach more people yes and um so and make sure you leave a comment even if it's hello just commenting for the first time but you want to hear something guys so i'm truly right only know that right and he, at abadis he's guyanese yeah. right so when we do the the, the youtube and um what was the, the youtube the analytics yeah the analytics dave we have um, a lot of Guyanese people on our YouTube channel. So, where my Trini people there? Why not support me, Trini girl here? Then, yeah, Trini people in Trini. What's going on here? I want my Trini people to support me too. What, what, what's going on? What's so up listen, with that? So, tell your auntie, tell your uncle, and your tell tante. your grandmother, and your tante, and your kaka, all of them. Tell all of them. Mm -hmm. Listen, I support your Trini people because I only get in all the love and support. Yeah, from the Guyanese this boy be telling kind of thing, you know? And uh, only like three Trinidadian people are support. Nah, that's a lie. <laughs> <laughs> But guys, I wanna we want to wish Kamani Bihari a happy, 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 happy birthday. Um shout out to her. She is a subscriber, but also we met her through the Gopi family. Shout out to the Gopi family. Um they introduced us to her. Today is her 50th birthday. And um actually she bought a house from us. From me this year, I sold a house to her. I represented her as the realtor and the broker. Um, so shout out to Miss Kamini. God bless you. We love you. And we will see you on Saturday. Celebrity. Woo! I wish you a happy birthday, celebrity. We love you very much. Very much. We will see you on Saturday. That's right. All right. What do you want to say? I was going to say enjoy and cook up and let Pokemon cook something for you. Pork man, I cook yes. up for sure. Tell cook some pork, some jira pork or something. No, 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 I think I'm fasting. Oh, you're fasting? Yes, yes, oh, yes. Okay. <laughs> so no jira pork then. No jira pork. Would you like to say something beautiful, Sarah? Happy birthday. Hello, <laughs> my Josh. Happy birthday. Hello, Leah. Happy birthday. Aww. <laughs> All right, guys. So I want to do a shout out. We want to do a shout out. So we have a list of names who've been commenting on our videos and stuff. If you don't hear, if you don't hear your names, Please, please forgive us. Um, just say, Trish, you didn't call me out. I'm yeah. like, I'm sorry. Leave a video there. Leave a comment. Trish, you didn't shout me out. What happened, man? Yeah, what's going on, Trish? What happened? You're lapsing. <laughs> all right. First of all, I want to shout out Miss Dilma T. She is from Georgia. Shout out to you, Miss Dilma T. We love you. We love you, love you, love you, love you. You're awesome, okay? And shout out to your son, too. Yes. <laughs> yeah, he always watches me videos. <laughs> shout out to Trisha Ariana. Miss Cindy Pancho, Miss yeah. Judy Maharaj, Miss France Anne, Miss Katy Payne, Sister Tracy from Woo! church. <laughs> Tracy, I still waiting for my Christmas gift, you know, man. <laughs> <laughs> if she if she if you hear she tell him today is a Christmas gift, you go dead with love <laughs> while we in church. <laughs> Sister Tracy, not easy, you know. All right. Shout out to Pharrell and family and Nell. Shout out to Uncle Jerry and Auntie, Auntie Mona. Um, shout out to her uh, her business that she has, Pharrell. Fairy Cakes and Cookies. She is in Kissimmee. If you're looking for yummy cakes and cookies and stuff, please reach out to her, okay? Uh, Uncle Jerry, nice to finally meet your boy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Shout out to GT Vibes. Barry Charles, Mr. Barry Charles. Christopher Bristol. <laughs> Chris. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> shout out to um, Gita Ali. Miss Gita Ali, guys, and if you guys are older, I, I respect people. I call it auntie and uncle. So if I'm calling you by your names here, um, forgive me because I don't know what age you are. I'm, I mean, I don't, I don't going to ask you what age you are, but I respect, you know, respect people who's older than us, especially our, our West Indian community. We have a respect. We grew it to always call people auntie and uncle, but I'm calling names out. So I don't know if you're an auntie or an uncle. So let me know. <laughs> Make sure you let me know. Is auntie such and such Correct. or uncle <laughs> such and such? Like auntie Kathy or uncle Jerry? Uncle Jerry, okay. Mm -hmm. 
Arona Ramdas Ra Radia, Mr. Sheldon Bihari, Miss Pinky Ramsaran, Miss Sita Bihari, Jennifer Suku, Auntie Gina from Ocala. Nice meeting you by Gopi's, uh, the birthday party at Gopi's house. Miss Yvonne King, Malika Karag, Auntie Nisha from New York. <laughs> Auntie Nisha, I don't know, we have um, some mutual people involved here. My <coughs> friend Sha says, yeah, I think is your niece. <laughs> mm -hmm. Big up to Auntie Nisha. My, um, Davy Sukla, big up to my Davy Sukla from Trini. Big up to you, darling. Yeah. Christy Lowe, big up to you, my dear, from Trini. Miss Bibi Muhammad. Uh, Mr. Ezekiel Andrews. Miss Annie Passad. Trini Queen, big up to you from Trini, my dear. Obviously, Trini Queen, Trini. <laughs> <laughs> it's not Guyanese Queen, it's Trini Queen. <laughs> I said we got Guyanese Queen. Queen right here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, big up to Vanessa Barron, Patricia Cicheran, Newborn 24, Auntie Beodat. Okay, Auntie Beodat is a, a nice auntie from Guyana. Thank you, Auntie, for all the love, all the, the message you be sending on Messenger on Facebook. Thank you so, so much. Okay, we love you. Okay. Um, Miss Yasmin Gopi, Miss Para Passad, big up to you from Canada. Hope you keep it warm because Canada more cold than Orlando. <laughs> well, you're probably freezing all your bum over there. Yeah, Mr. Ricky so cool too. He's from Canada. Oh boy. Big up to you, sir, and your beautiful family. Um, Miss Savitri 1972, Miss Sandra Rahak 9678, Majori Dampat, uh, Mr. Stephen. Gangadin, I pronounce it right. <laughs> from New York, right? Steven. Steven. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Big up to you, my dear. If not from New York, leave it in the comment below. So anybody not New York. Yeah. Gandia. I think I pronounced it wrong. Gandia or this is Life with Ajay's wife. Big up to Life with Ajay. Bro, we love you. We love your family. And one day we'll meet you in Canada. Ajay, big shout out, boy. We can meet in Canada or Florida, either way. Yes, matter. that's right. <laughs> Uh, my uncle, um, Anwar, Uncle Anwar from Okada, did you wish happy birthday? Happy birthday. Oh, oh no. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> thank, you. thank you, Uncle Anwar. Thank you. We hang out. We actually, Uncle Anwar can cook, you know, man. I see this man cook a goat by the Gopi family house. Oh my God. We lick my finger. It man. was goat or duck. Uh, it tastes like Trinidad. I was like, what? Is it Uncle Anwar from Trinidad? We thought you have Trinidadian, boy. I thought you was half Trinidad. <laughs> Uh, Miss Tara Lalau, thank you so much for all your support, my dear. Helen ba ba Bajanat, Mr. Anil Lach, Miss Pabwati Pab Singh, big up to you, my dear. Um, Usha Ramprasad, Alison Muhammad. Guys, you guys been always commenting on our videos. Thank you so much for the love and support. You guys are wonderful. Um, Miss Judy Jagu, Saria Maraj, they are in Delaware. That's a phone call we got recently. I'm big up to you guys. They're looking to move to Florida soon. So, so move, soon. move soon so we can do a meet and greet. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mr. Naram Kisun, Kaya, big up to you, my dear. Mr. Krishram Sami, big up to you, sir. Uh, Karishma Omrar, Did you, I think I, I recently saw you comment on our videos. Welcome to our channel, my dear. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Dati Suku, uh, Virgin Pers and Prasad. Um, Amrita Bhagwadeen, Miss Deborah Suraj, Miss Deborah, thank you so much for always commenting. All of you guys always commenting, okay? Uh, Raymond Lee, Miss Rebecca Lopez, I think she's in upstate New York, and uh, Mr. Boy R by you, and Angie BB. <laughs> guys, you guys are our subscribers. You guys are the ones who commented on our last video. Thank you guys so so much. We love, love, love you guys. And seriously, when we say we love you guys, it's not just talk, okay? We, it comes from our heart. We mean it, all right? So make sure you comment. If we forget your name, make sure you comment. Forgive us. Shame, tr tr Dave, Trish, chat me out next time. Just give me a yeah, shout Yeah, be like, what a lapsing, man. Don't yeah. be lapsing, so. All right. So now we have some fellow YouTubers, guys. They are, are phenomenal. They always are... They big us up, they shout us up, they always give us love and support, and we are really grateful for them. And they are family. We're in this family, um, you know, YouTubing, and, you know, we have to help each other grow, and, and we want to shout these YouTubers out, okay? Big up to them. If they're not on, 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 on the YouTube, they're always on the Facebook. So big up to you guys. Shout out to Anna's Kitchen, 
Guys, she is excellent. She cooks a real master Trini food boy. Hmm, I need to go live next to she in New York. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's your local family return. Krishna, they in New Jersey. Shout out to them. They're amazing. Real beautiful Guyanese family. They're loved. Yes. Uh, Krishna, I tell you, I want to try out that cure for the, um, the test, for the COVID test boy. <laughs> <laughs> they know what's so funny? We just found out from um, them that... We have a mutual, we have mutual people, like close family that they're, they're family of. So big up to you guys. Um, adventures with, uh, adventures and food with Priya. Shout out to you, my dear. Uh, White Trini. Big up to White Trini. We meet White Trini uh, Christmas Day and they are wonderful. White Trini and Shy Girl. You guys are wonderful people. The my girl, kids love you guys. The girl who is not so shy so more. Uh -huh, we see a DJ yeah. in Malik. Hey, I think uh, hey, that DJ and gig, that can work really good, you know, girl. For real, I uh -huh. got a side job. <laughs> oh my gosh. Shout out to Nikki and family okay. in upstate New York. God bless you guys. Thank you for always coming to our videos, Nikki. One love, brother. One love, Nikki. Yes, yes. Beautiful family. God bless you guys. Shout out to the Gopi family. I know we are shouted you just now, but shout out to you guys again. Thank you, Gopi, for all the love and support you and Debbie be giving us, okay? Big Thank up, you. big up to the boy Gopi and my boy Shark. Yeah, he friend Shark. The man Shark. That's my partner, man. He's a real shark, you know. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only shark man who frightens me water. The man said you only have been one time a day. He said that. <laughs> no, but you know what? Gopi and Shark laps in because guess what? They're supposed to do this ice bucket challenge and they didn't do it yet. Hey, so you guys make sure you let them know. Hey, when you do guys win the ice bucket challenge, yeah, you all I gotta tell them, all I gotta do this ice bucket challenge. It's not fear that, that Trish and Dave do this thing alone. Yeah, that's why I'm saying this shark frightening water, man. <laughs> <laughs> all right, uh, big up to Trini Style with Janish and Trinidad. Big up to him and his beautiful wife. God bless you, Auntie Vids. Thank you so much. Um, uh, big up to being Rocky. Thank you, Rocky, for the, the love you gave to Dave recently to us. Thank you so much. Uh, Trini How To guys, Trini How To is Trini Yorker's wife, and I really like her content. Um, it's about life, and she's straight up raw. Um, she don't sugarcoat anything, and I like that. So big up to Trini How To. Please give her a a shout out, and please subscribe to her channel. Okay, cook it with Ash, cook it with Ash. We love you. You was in South Florida. Next time you're in Orlando, here we are call. You know we number. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, chilling with Jake. What's the song chilling with Jake sing? Chilling with Jake. Ah, uh, pass the liquor. Hold oh, me, mama. <laughs> pass the liquor. But guys, it's not just a rum song. It's a family song. It's a hangout song. Yeah. So listen to the song, chilling with Jake, pass the liquor. We and support the song. We want this, this song to go all the way to Chutney Monarch this, this year. Yeah, man. We need yeah. some new fresh faces over there. Yeah. And I think my boy Jake, he got he got everything it takes to go up there. And man. the biggest Chutney Monarch is in where? Trinidad. <laughs> <laughs> Trinidad. Oh, okay. Trinidad. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right. And big up to um, Life with J. Big up to him again. He's in Canada. Please, please <coughs> I'm sorry, guys. Please give him a shout out. Please check out his content. There's, they are wonderful and we love them, okay? Mm -hmm. Big up to Queen Trish in Kentucky. Big up to you, my dear. Queen Trish, big up. <laughs> big up to Island Life and Sunil. You got to check out them, boy. His wife, Nisha, she is an amazing cook. Boy, I see that breakfast you guys make there. Oh my gosh, they make me hungry right away, boy. Nah, nah, when I come to Orlando, we got you got this fried chicken, Nisha. It is master, okay? <laughs> <laughs> and big up to Sandy's cup of tea, Auntie and Uncle Mike. Yeah. Tell him, tell him. Uncle Mike, you listen. You gotta tell me when you're coming to Florida, man. We gotta do something over here. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, whatever you there to call, man. Oh, they got to come down here, man. Come to the heat. Come yes, to the heat. Yes, uh, come down. <laughs> Let me hang out. Let me hang out. And big up to Trini Yorker. Andre, congratulations. You're 3,000. Uh, you're going, you're going 10 more thousand. You're going 13,000. Watch and see. You guys are good people. <laughs> yes. Love you guys. Yes, and make sure. Let me know when you come into Florida too, boy. Yes, yes, yes. And we have uh, Farmer Sham. Farmer Sham and his wife, uh, Priya, they are actually um, big on uh, TikTok, but uh, we don't have TikTok, TikTok, so we don't watch TikTok, but they started off a YouTube channel called Farmer Sham. Please check them out. They are really cool people. They love to fish. 
<laughs> they like to cook too. Show them some love and support, yes. guys. Farmer Subscribe Sham. to the channel. Farmer Sham. Yes, that's right. All right, guys, if we miss any other YouTubers, please forgive us. Um, please just, just say, Trish, what happened, you forget me. Comment on the videos. Yeah. Hey, you forget me, boy. Yeah, we'll be forgetting we saw what happened. <laughs> but anyway, guys, we love you guys. Um, stay blessed. Yeah. Um, you want to say something, baby, Leah? You want to tell them something? Yeah. Tell them, tell them, tell them. Tell them. What I say? Anything you want to say. Say bye. All right, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. Well, you, want, you want to say something, Josh? Um, have a good day, everybody. What about you, sir? Bye. <laughs> guys, we love you guys. Stay tuned. God bless you. And don't forget. Flash your flashlight in somebody's eye. No. <laughs> don't forget to be a light in someone else's life. Last night, and I was reading the Bible last night, and in Matthew 6, Matthew 6 it, uh, God said, your eyes is the lamp for your body. So with that being said, be careful what you see. <laughs> anyway, be like to somebody else. Bye. Love you guys. Bye. Bye.